Hi guys, um, I hope my signal's good enough in here to do this, but I just wanted to get on here and um, just a little testimony of how incredible God is. Because earlier today I was very scared, very scared because Robert's had a fever for a couple days and um, where he was breathing, they turned the, the ventilator off. He was breathing by himself for about eight hours in one day um and they tried again today and it didn't even last half an hour and he has getting fever 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 and um he just was looking rough um so i i you know uh my father-in-law came in his dad to spend time with him in the day so i can go home with the kids i was just so when i left i was worried and uh my father-in-law said that um you know, it was it was a rough day. I'll just say that he seemed to be in a lot of pain because they have been trying to change up his pain meds so that he could breathe without, you know, his uh, lungs being suppressed from the pain meds that he's on. So yeah, he's in pain and just sweating and a fever got up pretty high. And um, I was pretty, and then they said they had to take him into an emergency surgery um, because they had some foul smell and so I got up here as quickly as I can. Uh, my father-in-law came out and went um, to get his family. And then I just came up to the room and spent about two hours with Robert, two and a half hours. And one of those hours, one and a half of those hours was me so scared that that was gonna be my last time with him. And I was just praying, praying, praying. We were listening to music, Jesus is King. And um, and then, like, been tinkering with his pain meds, like I said. And then he opens his eyes, which he's been doing, opening his eyes some. And uh, I asked him, I said, do you like the music? And after, I'll tell you, after Kanye West, I played someone named Suf Sufjan Stevens. I don't even know how to say his name but Robert loves this guy. And one of the songs um, is, uh, I've got a lot of life in me. And he just started nodding his head to that. And they say it over, I got a lot of life in me. I got a lot of life in me. I got a lot of life in me. And he's just steadily nodding his head, nodding his head. And then, um, you know, then he would fall back to sleep. And then another one of the songs says, um, and he'll wake me up, he'll wake me up. And Robert woke up while they were singing that. And then he started, y'all, he started like through the breathe, the breathing too, he started pursing his lips like that. And I told the nurse, I said, is he, that looks like he's trying to give me a kiss. And he nodded his head. I said, honey, you want a kiss? And he went, I said, okay. So I went to go kiss him on his nose here. And he leaned in, so I'm giving a kiss on his nose. And um, it, things went on for like, an hour and a half like that before he went up to surgery. And it was like for that hour and a half, I had him back. And it just, um, it was uh, God telling me that number one, he was coming back from the surgery. And uh, number two, he's got a lot of life in him. That's all I could, that, just hearing that line and him nodding his head, him nodding his head. Um, so I just wanted to share this distress in the pressure that I was feeling before that time with him was unbearable and I just prayed and prayed to God to please get us through this to please heal him and then now he's back from surgery and they didn't find much of anything which is great which is so great we were afraid that his the wound that he has was severely infected because of the foul smell but it turned out it was just from the packing um He's back in the room, he's resting, things look good. It took about 20 minutes. Um, so I just wanted to share, and the, the part of this that is God working to me is the comfort that he gave me right before Rob went in, because I was so scared. Um, and God just gave me that gift of an hour and a half of getting my husband back for a minute, you know, for that hour and a half. And, uh, that, I mean, I don't know what's to come. We still have a long, long journey ahead of us. Um, not quite out of the woods yet. 
but uh, that an hour and a half was a real gift from God. And I just wanted to share that, y'all. The prayers are working. Um, us, including doctors, were pretty scared for what was to come. The nurses were nervous, too. But our prayers, all of us coming together, guys, he came back and nothing. It wasn't. They're still sending cultures. They're going to work it out. But it's working, y'all. So please keep praying. Keep praying for him. And uh, I know we're going to get through this. It's going to take time. And I just want to tell you all, I'm so, so, so grateful for the emotional effort you're putting into this for him. And you're holding up. I know you are. And you're sending God's love to him. And he feels it. Um, so thank you guys so much. And uh, have a good night. Keep the prayers coming. Um, and again, I'm so grateful to you all. I love you guys. All right. Have a great night. Bye-bye.